thesmartlocal.com Hi everyone, I'm Fauzi and welcome to a brand new episode of One in the Street. In a previous episode, we talked to Singaporeans about social smoking. But in this episode, we are delving a little bit deeper to find out what Singaporeans think about vaping. First question, how old are you guys? Turning 20 this year. 2019. 24. Other than the conventional cigarettes, what kind of other tobacco products are you familiar with? Vaping, cigars. The one that look like the snake on. It's called Shisha, you forgot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shisha, Shisha. You're like damn excited that y'all know this. The reason why we're talking about cigarettes is today because we want to talk about what people think about vaping. Are you familiar with the concept of vaping? It's quite cool. Uh. I've seen it on like Instagram. Is it a trend? E-cigarettes is actually a battery operated device. By heating this liquid that creates an aerosol which is then inhaled and then exhaled as a visible vapor. So that's why you're talking about like the, the, the rings and all that. That's a visible vapor. Lah. So what are the chemicals do you think there are inside these e-cigarettes? Quite a little bit of nicotine, I think. I only know nicotine. There's also other chemicals like benzene, which is uh, a commonly found chemical in car fuel, car petrol. Petrol yeah. in the lungs and all. Exactly. The other ingredients for maldehyde, also cancer causing, but it's also the chemical that is used for embalming dead bodies. Along with this, right, there are 113 other ingredients that are actually harmful to your body. Now that you know this, right, what do you feel? I'm quite shocked because I thought e-cigarette is, is not even harmful to your body. We shouldn't be putting this kind of things into our bodies. Mm. It's not healthy for us. Sounds like a very technologically advanced equipment. How much do you think it is? 100? Around less than $10 can buy already. Oh, is it? Isn't it illegal in Singapore? Very clever! Technically, it doesn't matter how much it costs because they are actually illegal in Singapore. Ah, so we're talking about the laws. Are you familiar with the consequences when it comes to flouting these laws? Fine. Imprisonment and fine. Not many people actually know this. Uh, For consumption, the usage or possession, it is a fine of up to $2,000. If you are caught selling, importing or distributing e-cigarettes, you are liable to up to $10,000 in fines or six months imprisonment or both. There's a concerning trend that more and more people are actually turning to e-cigarettes. In Hong Kong, there's been new re news reports that there's an increasing number of these primary 2 to primary 4 kids who are starting to smoke e-cigarettes. When you hear such a piece of news like this, how does that make you feel? I feel quite like, like the society a bit messed up now. <laughs> I feel like it's just not something talked about like okay, yeah. pretty regularly and like it takes more education and I guess like raising awareness for them to know about it and yeah. like whatever risk it might bring to their health. It's really bad because they are so young. At this age is where they start to form habits. Right. So when they do this, they will grow up to be like unhealthy. Why do you think people still vape? Out of curiosity, I think. Maybe they're not aware that it's illegal okay. and uh, people are still selling it, so mm. they just uh, do it. In the, the secret packs, they always tell you this is happening, this is happening but when you buy the Okay, I don't know if they're going to tell you or not. My parents also don't smoke, so I've never really been exposed right. to like those influencers. So yeah. I don't really think it's something I would get into. Uh, after what you said, like, it helps help, I don't think so. I don't want to, to trouble myself into having all these legal issues. I think it's better to just um, avoid this um, habit, bad habit altogether. Any last words for people out there watching this video? If you tempted to start, then just say no. Uh. Just try to say no. For those who watch this video, you know what is inside the e-cigarettes. So you just want to might want to think about before you're buying it. Yeah. Don't take e-cigarette out of curiosity or under peer pressure. Think about your own health. Uh. It seems that the people we spoke to had many misconceptions about vaping, especially with regards to how harmful they are. But it's also hopeful to know that with more awareness on the chemicals actually present in e-cigarettes, people will be less willing to pick them up. That's it for this episode of Word in the Street. As always, you can like, share and subscribe and watch our other videos right there. Until next time, bye!